the next middleware we are going to talk about is trim string what this trim string will going to do so one thing i'm going to show you is that if i try to register sarthak and uh, let's use another name so i will say bitfumes then bitfumes at gmail and before hitting register button i'm going to give lots of spaces here and lots of spaces here also so if i try to register and try to register it says okay it's already exist so what i'm going to do i'm going to have my sql pro here and i will delete this one okay so now i'm trying to register once more with all the spaces on the name like this and hit register button yeah i'm logged in i'm totally registered but you can see we don't have any spaces here yeah just we have a dot by mistake i have given that so we don't have any spaces here refresh no no space but let's again delete this register uh, this uh, user refresh because that user is not exist it will log out automatically then i'm going to remove this trim string middleware from our kernel file and yeah this trim string middleware is globally applied so just comment it out and now try to register once more i think you guessed it right because now i have not given trim string here so all these spaces will also be counted and saved with these spaces so if i refresh you can clearly see that this string is not trimmed having spaces here having spaces at the last so this trim string middleware is very important because we don't want white spaces or simply spaces to be submitted on our database because that uh, that are unnecessary things so the initial and the final uh, is white space or spaces are going to be trimmed not the spaces between because uh, if i try to register once more with different uh, names so bitfumes test so we have a space in between and let me get back yeah we have a trim string here so yeah we have a space here and we have a space at here and here also so test at gmail.com and secret123 secret123 and yeah we know these are going to be trimmed but not this one so register go here refresh yeah we have trimmed all the initial and last uh, spaces but not obviously the space bit in between so this is the power of using trim string but we know that password can have spaces and we want to allow the password to be having spaces so this is why we have a system here which can give that okay even though this uh, trim string is applied to everywhere not going to apply to password and password confirmation similarly if i say name now i'm trying to remove these two and once more register i think you know what's going to happen but let me show these things so i will say bitfumes and spaces then bitfumes gmail and one two three register and even though our trim string middleware is working fine because we have given that don't apply this trim string middleware to this name and that's why it has it has not applied to this name so this is the trim string middleware which is again very very important to have on every kind of application we can create with this laravel laravel framework if you want to learn more advanced stuffs and work on real projects head over to bitfilms.com slash courses section where all udemy courses are here and some of the premium courses just for this website so you can just subscribe to this website with a minimum amount on the plan section at the bottom and then you can have everything unlocked with no advertisement no hello hi just pure learning we will meet in the next episode till then goodbye